everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we're continuing Final Fantasy XIV. Oh, I'm so excited to get back into this. Um, so in the last episode we had our first uh, dungeon. And by the way, uh, just before I started filming, I read through those tutorials. So I went into my... Here. Active health. Here. And I read through the tutorials that I missed in the... When I was in the dungeon. So I have not missed any tutorials now. Uh, I'm up to date and now I understand better how things work. So that's awesome. So yeah, um, our main quest right now is Call of the Forest. I think we're supposed to go, yeah, we're supposed to go back to Gridania, but I have a few unlockable things to do here. So I think I'm going to finish them first and, oh, although for that one, I need to go to a lot of places. Maybe that one I'll finish later. Wait, do I have anything going on in here? Speak with at the armors and blacksmiths guild in Limsalomin. I wonder where that is. No, wait, that's not map. This is map. Gatekeeper. No, that's the wrong button. Hang on, this one. So, culinarian. Marauder. Where's blacksmith? No, wait, I can see it. Hang on. Uh, this one. So there. I'm there, so I need to go in this direction. Okay. <laughs> uh, have I attuned to this? It says there's one here. I don't think I have attuned to this one. Ooh. Yeah, I need to remember to pick these up as well. Aft Castle. Alright. This place is so pretty. And it's so Christmassy in here. I love it. So hang on. In that direction. So yeah, I'm gonna do whatever I have going on in here, and then I'll go back to, back to Gridania. Okay, now I should be able to see it somehow. Oh, there. Hmm. Oh. There. Oh, definitely. Um, wait, which one? Um... Wait, neither of these are my thing. No, my thing is over there. Oh, this is my thing. You are my thing. Jandalin sent you. Let me guess, the barmy fools lost his tools. Pardon me, the appendages of his very soul again. And is thrashing and tossing like at the end of days is nigh. The, may, the man brings it on himself. If he toned down the, the theatrics and went about his work like an earnest craftsman, I dare say he'd save himself these misunderstandings. No, I've not a whit of sympathy for the fool. You, however, have my pity indeed for having to play audience to his whining. <laughs> Any road, this should shut him up for a while. Tell him that if he loses these, I'll graft the next pair into his bloody hands. Okay, was that our last thing to do here? That's in Gridania, that's in Gridania, that's in Gridania. That's in Ulda, but I'm not gonna go there right away. So in that case, oh, it's so pretty in here. I swear, every time I come here, I feel like I find more and more Christmas here. <gasps> the tree. It's so quiet in here. I'm playing in the morning, so that could be why. <laughs> okay, so um, can I use my return even though I'm in a different city? Return to New Gridonia. I can? Oh, and I can do my class quest as well. I need to go do that as well. We need to continue that too. Okay. 
Oh, we're back here. <laughs> okay, where do we begin? We need to speak to Mio. We need to go continue our class quest, which was... Let's continue that as well now, so that I don't forget about it. Oh, this has changed. New Gudania, old Gudania. Oh. Yeah, Lancers. Yeah, because I need to continue. Oh. Christmas has come here as well. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, he's so cute! Oh, the little one with the bow! <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <gasps> oh my god! <gasps> Look at the decorations! See, I'm crying already. That, that, yeah, that didn't take long. I just want to play this every day. But since I'm filming this, I can't. <laughs> Guildmaster Ewine. I'm sitting in a weird way. <clears throat> There we go. Guildmaster Ewine has a trial in mind for you, which promises to be more dangerous than any you have faced thus far. Okay. I have been expecting you, Cat. You have been training hard, I trust. I would set you your next trial, one more dangerous than any you have faced before. But I would not send an unprepared woman to her death. Before we proceed, I must needs verify your progress with mine own eyes. You will face three experienced lancers in single combat. Defeat each one in succession and you will prove yourself fit to undertake the trial. Arm yourself and take your place in the training area. We begin when you are ready. Oh, do I remember how to battle? Oh, that's right, I moved the places of these. I need to remember how, where they are now. So this, my true and horrible thrust are the same, so that's gonna be my, that's my range, my piercing thingy. And then I have my blood bath there. That's gonna keep me alive and my heal there. Okay, I, okay, let's, let's. No, I'm targeted at me. I need to be targeted to the location. No, I'm targeted at me. That doesn't work. Wait. Destination. That's destination. Waiting. Lands of Destiny. Um, we'll see. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna use my this so that it heals me while I do this. There we go. Who else? Next? Oh, it's one at a time. Okay. Oh, go away. There we go. More? 
Impressive cat, most impressive. You are ready to face the trial. Yet I did not exaggerate when I said it would be dangerous. Make no mistake, to take this test is to risk death. Knowing this, do you still wish to proceed? Sure. You disappoint me. Back again, are you? Oh, is it full, full quest? Oh, yes. Uh, that woman is the only soul in this pathetic excuse for a guild who shows any promise. Which is why I counseled her to leave you. Alas, she chose to remain in your house of cra cravens. Such a waste. This guild has outlived its purpose, and I mean to see its door shut and barred for good. If you wish to object, I invite you to do so with lance in hand. You have pink eyes? I didn't notice that before. You do not want... You do not want for confidence, sir, but answer me this. What grudge do you hold against us? For what reason did you choose this of all crusades? I detest cravens who would proclaim their courage and like nothing better than to crush them. That is my reason. Well, the, fi the fixity of your purpose is clear, even if your reasoning is not. So be it. Suffice it to say, you will not have your way without a fight. I have something in my eye. Oh, that's bothering me. Okay. Oh, but do not presume that I will be your opponent. No, you must face the Lancer over whom you so grandly claimed mentorship. The one woman among us whose potential you can... Condes condescend to acknowledge. Cat shall represent us all. As guildmaster, I wager the fate of the guild upon her lands. We're fighting for quest? Ha! Do as you will, coward. It is your guild to throw away. You may even set the terms of the contest. Very well. Cat here is to undertake the tri a trial. I challenge you to complete the task before she does. Wait, no, don't give me a timer. I'm not good with timers. You are to travel to East Shroud. Where's that? And prove your courage before the Lord of the Bramble Patch. Lord of the Bramble Patch. He's a giant amongst boars, unrivaled in strength and savagery, and ruler over all his kind. You must go before his this fearsome creature and stand your ground. Know, though, that the Lord of the Bramble Patch will not grant an audience to just anyone. You must needs present him an offering of the bloody tusks of his subjects, the wild boars that inhabit his domain. When you have prepared your offering, leave it upon an area of trampled earth. Drawn to the stench of blood, the Lord of the Bramble Patch will soon appear. This, that is all. Are there any questions? No? Then let the trial commence. Obtain bloody boar tusks from wild boars. Where is that? Yeah, see, this is a place where I have not been before. Um, I'm here. Oh! There. I have not attuned to that one, so I should go there. Um, okay, we have that one. Okay. There's seriously something in my eye and it's bothering me. Point of mobile. Oh, oh my god. Wow, it's really something bothering in my eye. Wait, let's try this again. How much does it cost to use this fairy? So is it Sweet Bloom Pier then? I happen to be heading across the lake to Sweet Bloom Pier in the East Shroud, yes. Wait, it doesn't cost anything? Where on earth am I now? 
Ah, the bramble patch is over there. We have a unattuned thingy here. We might want to do that. Wait. Okay. In that direction. There would be a short way to get to the bramble patch, but do I want to go attuned to that thingy first? I'm, I'm going to go attuned to that thingy first so that I can get a faster way to get here later. Ah, fate joined. Uh, well, I mean... Should we join a fate then? Oh, I have to manually... Oh, okay, I see, I see, I see. Level sync. Thank you, now I can take part. And I'm right away gonna do this, because it keeps me alive. Nope! Did not mean to do that though, but okay. That was just... Trying to choose my targety. There we go. Where do we have the next one? I mean, to be fair, I now have the challenge log, so I think one of the things that I was able to do was join fates. Although I think it has changed now to a different week, but I don't know if they stay the same. Where do we have more? Oh, there. Oh, you. Okay. There we go. I can see someone. Hello. Don't you dare run away from me. By the way, that begs the question, where is it? Logs, challenge log. No, it has not changed. Fate. Complete five fates with the highest rating possible. So I've done one already. Awesome. Okay. Why do I feel like this episode is going to be one of those where I go absolutely nowhere in the main story? <laughs> I, I have a feeling. Oh, this place looks pretty. Yeah, I'm gonna attune to that one. Yay! Ooh, there's another fate. See, now that I have extra rewards for these, now I wanna do them. Oh, that's a big bug. Where is it that I need to go? I need to go... Oh, that's not... Okay. Hmm. Okay. Let's do this, then. There. Oh! Well, that didn't take long. Oh, I was helping them, I guess. I'm sorry if I take, took away some of your points. Oh, I'm gonna have to fight my way through all of these. Oh. Hmm. 
Oh, your friend came here. There. Fate joined. Oh, yeah, I need those wild boars. Where's the fate, though? You're watching a cutscene? Okay. Oh, okay, I guess we're doing these. Okay, let me do this just in case. So that we don't have any accidents. Oh, no, 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 no. Mm-hmm, okay. Trent is the fate. Um. Wait! Oh, you were attacking me too? Oh, there's a lot of stuff attacking me here. Oh, I need to get away! Oh, that was the fate. That That's the fate thing. Okay. Fine, let's then do the fate thing as well. <laughs> See, we're doing a lot of extra stuff today. That was not planned. That's just how things go sometimes. Oh, hello. No, not you, not you. Can I target, thank you? No, not that one. Can I, oh my God, the targeting is a pain. Invalid target, okay. 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 No. The targeting is a pain when there's a lot of stuff happening. Now I have disregarded my fate thingy. I have two tasks here at the same time. Okay. All right, did that. That's gonna... Okay. Don't you run away from me. Okay, now at least that's done. Okay, they're leaving. Great, now I can focus on this. <laughs> Hello. You're not gonna notice me? <laughs> Let's get a little bit closer here so that your friend is not gonna see me. There we go. And this one. We need to go deeper in here. Mm 
Here we go. Now those trees don't look to be red, so now they're not going to attack me, right? have one more. There. Ooh, I need to get away. There we go. Now I've got everything. Leave the bloody board tossed on the trampled earth. Where? Oh, there. So we're getting like, oh, yeah, here. Hello. Do I need to do something with this? waiting. Yep, we are at the- oh. Ooh. Ooh, scared. God, there's a lot of stuff happening in here. I need to do my this. happening in here. I can't see what's going on. Duty failed. How did I fail? I didn't die. When a powerful enemy is readying a special attack during this battle, the area of impact will begin to glow. Yeah, I know. Leaving the glowing area before the attack is initiated will ensure that you do not suffer any damage. If an NPC has joined you in a quest battle, he or she will often provide you with hints displayed in a special textbook near the top of the screen, heed their words, and you may just emerge victorious. In addition to the rel relieving of past events, 
and the understanding of unlearned languages, the echo can provide you with extra strength when a battle turns sour. If you happen to be defeated during a quest battle, when you return for a second attempt, you will find that your attributes have been given a temporary boost. So wait, what did I do wrong? Is there like a main dude? Let me read what's in the chat box because there's some whole quest ones. Such true. Here's even. Ah, uh, nothing, just babbling. So wait, is there like a main dude that I have to beat? And I was just defeat trying to defeat the wrong ones. Now I'm confused. I would love to know what I did wrong before going in there, because otherwise I'm just gonna make the same mistake. Hmm. There were so many... Th uh, we have... Okay. Let's try that again. Let's see if I can... What did I do wrong? There's a lot of these. Hmm. So wait, let me take a look. So the question thing, okay, so this one. Okay. This one. We want to hit this one, I guess. I want to have this one. I could be wrong, but I... If I'm doing something wrong right now, I don't understand what it is. Or do I just need to be higher level for this so that I can... What, what does... What do I mean? Well, now something different happened. different okay so now I did better You shan't find much sport in these two. Come back another day, my friend. Well done, cat. You have completed the trial. Okay. I think... Okay. I trust you now see the truth in my words. Hurling yourself into the midst of danger is not courage, it's folly. No, this proves nothing. I refuse to accept. You refuse to accept the weakness within you. <laughs> Bye. No cat, leave him be. Your work here is done. Return to the guild. I shall see you there presently. Presently.
Are you gonna take me there? No. Um. Hang on. Teleport. Oh, these teleport here, so it's easier for me to return. This way and then take my... Then take this. Yes, I think that's the easiest. Uh, Lancer skill. Okay. Hello, Egoine. I will not lie to you. You are no match for the Lord of the Bramble Patch. Had you betrayed any hint of fear, he would have gored you in the space of a moment and feasted on your entrails. But you stood your ground, holding fast to your composure and resolve. Thus, you were able to stare terror in the face and survive unscathed. Well done, Cat. You have overcome the greatest hurdle in the quest to become master of your own courage. You may now bring to bear the full extent of your abilities upon even the mightiest of foes. As for Falquest, where? Where? Well, if there is a shred of reason left in him, he will have learned the self-same self lesson as you this day. Painful though the experience must surely have been one can only hope that it will serve to open his eyes to the truth go forth cat and prepare yourself for future trials i look forward to our next meeting <gasps> so i get an iron lance awesome and my options this gives me a lot of strengthy stuff but i love my jacket this is oh holy crap that's a lot of defense and magic defense that i should take Yeah. Yeah, I think I want the iron salad. This one. So then I will faint. I need to check that. Hang on. This, this. So this, we're gonna change. I have plundered goggles. Oh, they would have been as good as... When did I get these? Uh, well, this would have changed what I chose there, but okay. So which one is better? Strength 2. So these... This is a little bit better, I'd say. Direct hit rate. Determination plus 1. I think I still want this. Okay, and when can I continue this? Level 25. No, that's not the button. That is the button, though. Okay. All right, so I did my Lancer stuff. Now I can move forward. Okay, so I have... <sighs> Where's Carpenter's Guild? Have I attuned to that? Wait, that's the main thing, isn't it? So wait, hang on. If I go here, Aetherite Plaza, Archer's Guild, Aetherite Plaza. Um, Snow White. Oh yeah, that dude. Yep, I'm at the right place. A message from Jandelaine, you say? So he's lost another one. Does the man not understand that wood doesn't simply grow on, or actually does, at least in a matter of speaking, but the fact remains that resources are in short supply. For all his flowery words, if his tools were truly an extension of his very being, one would think he'd find a way to hold on to them for more than a fortnight or two. 
Jandalin's skills are not to be doubted, but his temperament leaves much to be desired. Still, it is not my place to judge. Take this to him and let us both hope that he will write his ways. Awesome, and then I only need to speak to someone in Ulda, but I'm not in Ulda. I'm gonna continue that when I get to Ulda. Wait, are these... Are these, like, class things? Wait, what's this one? Greetings, adventurer, and welcome to the Carpenter's Guild. We are the artisans who take wood and grant it new form and purpose as the archer's bow, the lance's spear, and the novice's shield. If carpentry holds any appeal, you should consider joining our guild. Might you be interested in learning the ways of woodworking? Um, no, not right now. No, so be it. Know that our door remains open, however. Should you find that you have mind to join us after all, I will be happy to furnish you with the necessary information. Okay, so woodworking. We have woodworking here. There's another somewhere here. Or is it outside here? No, it's one of those. Okay. So I do want to see what those unlockable things are, because some of them open up a lot of gameplay aspects, like I did with the challenge log. So I do want to I do want to check them out. What else do we have here? Okay, so I guess let's go speak to Mion then. Hello, Mother Mion. I'm here to continue with my main quest. Take a seat wherever you like, friend. Our waitress will come and come to take your. Oh, it's you, Cat. It's so good to see you again. What's that? Here at Badron's suggestion, you say. The foul-mouthed rogue sends me word that an adventurer might be along for the job, and it turns out to be you. Well, this makes things a lot easier, doesn't it? With regard to the task in question, there is a fair bit to tell. Let me know when you're ready to hear the details, and I shall brief you. Oh, I completed this. So now our main quest is fire in the gloom. Fire in the gloom, that doesn't sound good. Okay. Tell me more. Uh, Mion is waiting to brief you on your task. Okay. Ready for that briefing? Good. Now then, here's the long and short of it. Beg pardons for interrupting, Mion. Oh, Lewin. Beg pardons for interrupting, Mion. But our need grows ever more pressing. Have you? Have you? Have none stepped forward? And good morrow to you too, Bow Lord. Your need must be pressing indeed for you to honor us with a visit. The good news is, your journey hasn't been wasted. I'm pleased to report that we have a volunteer at last, and one who comes highly recommended at that. Well, if it isn't our very own woman for all seasons. You certainly have a knack for appearing when you're most needed, Cat. My thanks for answering the call. I love the music here. <laughs> Like that melody part. I now time is of the essence, so I shall proceed directly to the heart of the matter. We wish for you to nip a potential threat to Gridania in the bud. Okay. Beneath the central shroud, there lies an underground underground burial site called the Tomtara Deepcroft. Wait, we've heard that name somewhere. Central beneath the central shroud. Okay. Their place was once a uh, Gilmoran settlement, but we Gridanians have long in interred our dead there. Of late, however, shadowy figures have been seen skulking about the Deepcroft, and with ever-increasing regularity. Based on the accounts of various witnesses, we suspect that these individuals belong to the lambs of Dalamud, a doomsday cult which sprung up prior to the Calamity. These sea lots have proven themselves dangerous in the past, and we leave them to their own devices at our peril. Ordinarily, I would have dispatched my best men to discover the deep craft with orders to flush the cultists out. Alas, the calamity decimated our ranks, and the limited forces at, our, at my disposal are constantly required to keep the Ixal at bay. Since we thwarted their attacks on the Guardian Tree, the birdmen have not allowed us a moment's respite. They have probed every 
elm of our defenses in search of a weakness, compelling me to spread, 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 what spread? Uh, spread our forces far more thinly than I would like. The situation so being, we have no choice but to entrust the task of dealing with the lambs of Dalamut to others. Can we rely on you to handle this matter, Cat? Sure. You have my gratitude. Once you've seen uh, to your preparations, pray make your way to the deep craft and identify yourself to the guard posted at the entrance. Entrance? He will apprise you of the latest developments. That is all. Is that going to be another dungeon? Be careful out there, you hear? May the crystal guide you and keep you. Quest accepted. Speak with the quiver man at the entrance to the Temptera Deep Crawl. Um, I know people said don't do this now, but um, I'm just gonna open up because it's the unlockable thing, so I'm just gonna open this up, if that makes sense. If that's how it works. Um, Contrant is responsible for assigning guild, guild leaves, guild levs. I have no idea which way, uh, at the Carline Canopy and is offering to give you an introduction to the world of Live Force. See, this is what I want to do. See, yes. Mother Mion has told me much of your endeavors, Cat. Have you considered attempting one of the guild lefts available here at the Adventures Guild? Guild lefts are the means by which we document requests for assistance from the citizenry prior to assigning them to adventures possessed of the necessary skills. From battlecraft labs that require the extermination of monsters to tradecraft labs that ask for the creation of goods. Oh, so we have like crafting quests here as well. The task we term lev quests are many and varied in their nature. Okay. Should, you in should your interest be piqued, I suggest you make your way to Bent Branch Meadows and speak with Tierney. She will be happy to set your feet on the path to completing your first love quest. Oh, well now I have more stuff here. <laughs> I am gonna be ignoring all of these. These like, just random side quests for now. But everything that's like an unlockable thing, unless it's a class thing, then I do wanna look into them. So wait. Where are my things? Speak with... Uh, so that's right there, okay. Um, oh, shitty, shitty. There. Uh, this one is... Fire in the gloom. So that's over there. And then I also have... This one. That's over there. These are in very similar places. Okay, so for the f for my first, I'm gonna teleport myself to Bent Branch Meadows. Oh, it costs money. That's okay. Oh my god, I've been playing for almost an hour. I don't wanna stop, I never wanna stop. One of my tasks is here. But is that gonna be... Yeah, is that gonna trigger um, some kind of a thing that I don't wanna do right now? Let's see. Greetings, adventurer. My name is Tierney, and I'm in charge of assigning local lift quests here at Bench Branch Meadows. Because I would like to just open this up, not actually start doing them, if that makes sense. Um... Contrant convinced you to seek me out, did he? Then I shall assume you have a basic understanding of what accepting a guild lift might entail. Something? But first things first, I must be certain that your skills are a match for your enthusiasm. The Adventurer's Guild would not approve of me sending a fledgling hero to her death or dishonor for want of the requisite capabilities. Take a moment to peruse the task outlined in this guild leave. Do you believe yourself up to the challenge? Oh, accepting guild lives. Speaking with the local distributor of guild labs known as Levmet Meat will bring up a list 
Speaking with a local district. Ah, oh. we'll bring up a list of available quests. Highlight a quest to display its objectives and select your accept to add the quest to your journal. Leave allowances are required to accept leave quests. Oh, okay. Uh, you will be granted three leave allowances every 12 hours, up to maximum of 100. You may accept as many as 16 leave quests at once. Okay, so you get three allowances every 12 hours. What? How much do you... So it's one allowance, one quest. Or how does that work? Battlecraft. Wait, no. Hang on. Uh... Uh, uh, hello. Uh, I can't go between Battlecraft, Fieldcraft, Tradecraft. Okay. Too close to home. A pack of anals has been spotted near Bench Branch Meadows, far from the usual hunting grounds on Naked Rock. The local chocobo keeps. Um, can I go? Oh, this is how I scroll. Okay. Uh, the local chocobo keepers are worried that it is only a matter of time before the hungry scales can stray too close to the stables and endanger their birds. To prevent the worst, the woodwailers are seeking volunteers to find and call the creatures. Left quest objectives are deemed complete when all targets have been slain. Be aware that some targets may attempt to flee the battle and join with reinforcements, making it imperative that you deal with them before you have a Uh huh. Time limit, 20 minutes, location, bench fresh meadows, client, moguls, gift mounts, stable hand, history. Okay, I'm not gonna do this right now, but these are basically like extra stuff that I can do to get, do, does it say here what I get from doing this? A little bit of money and a little bit of experience. This is level 10. Okay, well, I'll look into those later. Um, what else did I have? Now I have a lot of things. I like it. So that we're going to leave for now. That's our main thingy. That's going to be there. And that's all way over there. Okay, so let's go. <gasps> oh my god, that is a dungeon. Because it has that icon on it. Oh shit. I've been playing for an hour. How long of a thing is that going to be? Should I... Hmm. Dang it. I think I might want to start the next episode with that because I don't know how long that's going to take because I've heard that those dungeons can take up to like, I don't know, 30, 40 minutes. I've been playing for an hour already, so maybe I should start the next episode with that. That would be a lot less stressful for me. Um, so how about this one then? That's actually close to where that other thing is. Do we have any, we don't have any, sh we don't have any shards here. I'm gonna get us to the, whatever the lavender beds thing is. Cause that's been, that's been there for so long now that I just kind of want to get it done. <laughs> oh yeah, this place, I remember being here. So wait, emblem, you, oh pretty. A good morrow to you, miss. What can I... Ah, you wish to know about the auctions. Very well, allow me to explain. There is a growing concern that our immigration policies have been a tad restrictive in the past. And so the Seatseer Council and the Order of the Twin Adder have, with the blessing of the elementals, uh, decreed that the lavender beds are s blah, be set aside for adventure adventurers. Adventurers who possess the necessary funds to purchase and maintain their estate, that is. Well, obviously, that is not me. Um, should you look upon the beds with your own eyes, though, I think you'll agree that it's well worth the price. Have a word with the skipper over yonder. She'll ferry you across. A recruit stationed at the pier can tell you more about beds once you've arrived. To proceed with the quest where the harlow, you may visit any residential ward within the lavender beds. Huh? Journey 
to the lemon juice heads. Here's. This fairy is bound for the lavender beds. Will you be traveling with us? Yes. Housing. Yeah, this is not relevant for me right now, but I want to open it up. Uh, each of the three nations has established a residential district. Okay. Wherein like-minded adventurers can establish a base for their activities. <gasps> that looks pretty. Each residential district is divided into wards, which in turn house 60 plot, plots of land each. Wealthy individuals may purchase plots of land upon which to build their own estate halls, while free companies may jointly, jointly purchase plots. Those seeking simpler quarters may instead purchase a room in the apartment buildings found in each of the residential districts. Okay. Wait. Ward number. Okay. Estate halls and apartments can be customized by installing fixtures and placing furnishing. Please note that in the case of estate halls, specific company privileges are required for customization. More information on housing can be had by speaking with the resident caretaker stationed at each residential district. So this is um, Final Fantasy meets uh, Sims. Journey to the lavender bed. So wait, I go. Whoa, dear lord. So I choose a ward. I. It, does it matter? So these are these like different locations. See, I want to try stuff out so that you know. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry, it's so pretty. The house with the eyes in Speak with the servant recruit, okay? Where am I now? I thought I would just attune myself, but okay. I will talk to them, I will, I just, I wanna look around. I'm sorry, this is a weird episode, I am fully aware. It's more like an exploration episode, because I've been very strict being like, main story, class quest, main story, class quest. This is the first time I'm allowing myself to do extra stuff, really. And I just want to explore. All the Christmassy things and the trees. This is such a beautiful place. Housing enthusiast. Oh my god, look at the little area on the water. Can you imagine sitting there having a cup of coffee? I want to live here. And the music is so cute here. Oh my god. See, this is, this is, this is bad. This is bad for me. That's, I'm, oh my god, this. I'm, 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 I'm crying. Oh my god. Look at, oh. Ethernet shard. Look at the pink flowers. Look at the flower. I'm home! That's a pink house! With a moogle! Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. This is such a beautiful place! Like, in real life, I would want to live here. Oh my god, this place is gorgeous! Like, Whoever designed this place? Whoa. Okay. Oh my god. Are these like... All the buildings that I'm seeing, are these like... Players' houses? Like... 
Like seriously, what? I love the music so much. I don't know where I am anymore. Yeah, I need to go there and then to the left and then to the left, okay. Yeah, see, I know that this is not relevant for me in a long, 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 long time, but I want to know about these because obviously I get more and more attached to the game as I see these. Oh my god, little tulips like that. The little, oh. This is how you sell a game for me. To me. <sighs> Hello. Greetings, adventurer, and welcome to the Lavender Beds. Oh, you come at the behest of a Gridanian woman. I regret to inform you that these plots are reserved for adventurers. But I am an adventurer. A poor sprout. <laughs> Your friend will not be permitted to take part in the auction. auctions. You, on the other hand, would be more than welcome to participate. Should you have a mind to purchase a plot for yourself, pray speak with the resident caretaker. He can guide you through the process. Okay. That's in Central Shroud. Okay, so now I can leave this place. Okay, can. I have to scratch that. That's where I want to have my coffee. Just when I think that Final Fantasies can't get any better, they throw something like this to me and I'm like, Wait! No, yeah, I have to do it this way. Leave. Oh, shit. Okay. Now I'm here. Is there a way for me to teleport myself to... You know what? There is. There is a teleport. Central bench, 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 bench meadows. That's where I need to be. And somewhere in here... Oh, that's how I started the quest, so maybe this will finish the quest now. Good to see you again, friend. Did you learn anything about the lavender beds? Yes, I learned that that place is beautiful and I want to live there. <laughs> oh, adventures only. Is that so? Well, these are trying times and it's more important than ever for Gridania to attract capable individuals like yourself. I'm sure that one day my dreams will come to fruition. One day I'll have my own cottage and stables filled with my own beloved chocobo. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry, I want that. <sighs> now it's completed. Lavender beds, Aethernet now accessible. The residential district Aethernet for the lavender beds can be accessed through the Gridanian Aetherite. Now it's done. It's, I've had it there for so long and now it's done. Awesome. Uh, in the next episode, I promise, the first thing that we do in the next episode is we're gonna go to that dungeon and we're gonna handle that. I just, I didn't wanna push it here because I didn't know how long that would take uh, with the queue time and everything. So yeah, in the next one, we're gonna do that right away. And I'm gonna try to focus on the main story in the next episode. <laughs> There's just so much to do here. Uh, but anyways, I'm gonna end this episode here, so thank you so much for watching. If you like this, give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, consider subscribing, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.